welcome back YouTube. We are a little way behind on this project, just a little bit. Yeah. On our elevated deer blind. Uh, it's October 23rd. And we've got like about a week to finish this. Uh, we've been, I'm busy at work, so it's been a little bit tough. But we wanted to go over how we stood this up, considering it's 12 feet in the air. Now, I didn't do the actual filming of it when we did it, just because there was way too much swearing, and I, you, we just would have heard a giant beep. So, it was not easy. Um, I've seen plenty of guys on YouTube, and you can look it up on YouTube too. Um, guys jack them up with trucks. They pull them up with ropes, tractors, four-wheelers. Some guys just push them up. I thought we were going to be able to push this thing up. But I think the thing I have going against me is I use 2x8 for floor joists. So it's a little heavier than 2x6. And it's 12 feet up. But this is how we did it. We basically had it laid down. And we already had our brackets on it. And we stuffed two poles in. And then put our cross piece, cross member, on the bottom and on the side. And then we kind of flipped it over and attempted to put the other sides on it. Well, guess what? That didn't work. Um, and these, these cross members are going to be doubled and I need to get 16 foot ones to go from the top on an angle down to the bottom. So this was just temporary to stand it up. They're all coming down and these will be doubled. There'll be one on the front and then one on the, on the back side up in, a, in an X in an X pattern and then in between we'll put some 2x4 pressure treated blocking so that it doesn't you know wiggle around I mean as it is now it's pretty sturdy just I want the 16 footers and then we got 12 foot ones running around the bottom those will be doubled up same thing and basically we have to level this thing now because I didn't have a level area before so and we got to trim some more branches because obviously put 8 foot high wall ain't gonna make it um, so what we did was we had two legs on cross members so it kind of made it a little rigid and then we took two by fours and temporarily screwed them into the box there and so two of us kind of hoisted this thing up hanging on to that two by four and then me had to hold the whole thing up once we got up there and then we kind of finagled our other our other posts in and kind of just scooted them up in there and then we kind of pulled it, everything back so it looked good um, and then we put our cross members on and then we screwed in the brackets up top on the one onto the post so it was not fun it took three grown men and a fourth guy would have made it easier and the reason why i couldn't pull it up with my truck was because of where i was tucking it you know i was tucking it up in the woods here so you know the guys that use trucks and things like that they they were you know plopping them out in a field and if i was putting it out in the middle yeah i would have roped it up and put all the legs on and just kind of popped it up it wasn't easy and like i said there was just no filming going on that day lots of swearing possibly a few beers and uh i'm glad it's up so now like i said we're just gonna gonna level it out and then we'll put our plywood up top after it's leveled and our regular reel braces are in and then we'll trim that branch Start putting our walls up and our sheathing, side it, put our windows in. That's it. This was the most unfun part of the entire project. It was just, it was not fun. You missed it. You lucky for you. But that's how we got ours up. Just a quick little story. Um, sorry, I didn't really film anything, but like I said, but uh, that's it. Hope it helps any of you standing one up. If it was eight foot high, no problem. Could have just put it all together on the ground. The, the framework and then just the three of us could have stood it up but being that high up was not fun so comment like subscribe maybe you guys have a better way of trying to tuck one of these things in the bushes some of you have still stood up tall ones like this you know i i was racking all kinds of ideas but that was what we came up with just kind of prop it up the longer board and hold it and wedge those front ones in and embrace it all right well Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for subscribing to our notification bell. Comment down below and like this video. Catch you later.